Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. If you haven't been here before, my name is Coral. And um, basically in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my step-by-step -step and all the products that I use on a day-to-day -day basis. So um, when I do go out and I am like wearing makeup just to go to like, the shops and that kind of thing, this is the look that I always go to. It's just so easy to do. It only takes about like what half an hour to do, maybe a bit longer depending on how tired I am. And yeah, this is always the look that I like to do. So if you want to find out how I, you know, end up with this, then all you have to do is just keep on watching, right? So here I am, bare faced, no makeup on at all. And I'm gonna go through the basic steps with you of what I do when I am wearing, you know, like makeup for the day. Like I said earlier, this is like my everyday makeup routine. Um, so yeah, like, I'm just going to stop chatting now and just get on with it. So obviously the first step that I do is prime and I use the Benefit Professional Primer. Um, you know, it's supposed to minimise the appearance of pores and all that kind of thing. So I just kind of put that on my finger and then just kind of rub it into my face. So yeah, now that I am all primed, I'm going to go in with my foundation and I use the Estee Lauder is it? in Ivory Nude and you know, I've had this quite a while and it'll last me, it's last me absolutely ages, um, you know, it's absolutely brilliant and it's probably one of the best foundations that I've tried, especially for like everyday use. Um, so yeah, and basically all I do with this is I just, it's not like a pump or anything, so I just pour it a little bit onto my hand. Like that, and I always leave it beside me just in case I need a little bit more, and then I just kind of, you know, put it on my face like you would any other foundation. And I always use a beauty blender. I think it works so much better than um, like a brush. It doesn't appear streaky or anything like that. And I think I'm definitely gonna need some more foundation. And um, yeah, I just think it's it's just so much better. So yeah, and I usually go over my eyelids as well with my foundation. Then next, I'm gonna go in with my Wake Me Up um, concealer in Ivory. You can literally get this from like any drugstore. And um, I'm just gonna put this under my eyes. I don't have a lot left, so <laughs> under my eyes. and on my chin I'm going to leave that out because I'm going to need that to do my brows in a minute as well and the blender line Right, now my next step is my Laura Mercier um, loose powder in shade translucent translucent and um, yeah basically I'm just going to use this to bake um, you know like every other single person on YouTube does and um, yeah so I'm just going to put this underneath my eyes if I can even get any more beauty blender And obviously this is supposed to help stop it like creasing under your eyes and that kind of thing. And I'm just gonna put some on my chin. And um, obviously baking is my favourite part of makeup. And then while that's kind of like setting or whatever, I'm gonna do my brows and then do the rest of my baking. For brows, I use the goof the goof proof brow pencil by Benefit. And it's in the shade, I think it's in shade 4, yeah, it's in shade 4. And I'm just going to put a mirror in front of me because it's my brows. So yeah, I always start from the inner corner. 
and then just kind of like flick it out a little bit and I kind of like round it down a little bit because this brow is a pain to do. I foot to the pot already. And that is why we leave the uh, concealer brow. So now that I've uh, fucked my eyebrows up, and I'm just going to use the other side which is like the like, spoolie and I'm just going to kind of brush the products through my brows and then we're going to start them out with a little bit of concealer. So now I'm going to go back in with my Wake Me Up um, concealer and I'm just going to go in the middle and make like a dinosaur like print, footprint and then along the top and then um, just along the bottom. Like that. I'm going to get my beauty blender again which is really dirty and disgusting and that also has translucent powder on it. Oh well. And I'm going to blend all of that in. So there's my brows done. Now I'm just going to go in back with my translucent um, powder and just put that on my forehead, just in between my brows. And then going down my nose. Like so. And then I'm also going to put a little bit more under my eyes. I don't know if you're supposed to do this, but... Oh, I don't know, so... Right then, and then while that's doing that, um, I'm just going to go in with my contour kit from Anastasia Beverly Hills. It's in light to medium, and I'm just going to use this this middle um, bottom one here, and I'm literally going to use I'm literally using this brush that I got from Avon when I was about 12 years old, maybe, and yeah. So I just dab that in to tap, up, tap off the excess and then kind of like squidge my brush together so it goes really thin and go along uh, my cheekbones. Like that and it looks really sharp at the moment but I am going to blend it out, don't worry, I'm just carving it out for the moment. I'm just going to do exactly the same for the other side. kind of carved out and um, I'm just going to carve out the um, jawline and get rid of them, um, all those tensions <laughs> and then I'm just going to go on my temples and yeah do my forehead with the same shade And before we go any further, I'm going to obviously go back in with my loose powder again and then just put it under the contouring that I have just done on my cheeks. So next, I am going to be using the uh, Cheek Parade palette by Benefit and I'm going to be using the Hula Light Bronzer, this one, and then the one um, next to it for the blush. I'm just going to be using the... Um, the brush that comes with it and just like so I don't really like like to use bronzer that much to be honest with you yeah Okay, so that's that bit done, and then obviously the um, blush. And I always smile to myself, and it really like, obviously brings out the apples of your cheeks, so it's easier to apply. And then I start on the outside, and I just kind of like make the way in. Okay, I think there's way too much on there, but would have would have broke it anywhere. So all that's left to do now is to be, like, wipe away all of the baking and I'm going to be using this 
fluffy and my foundation brush and yeah. Right, so the next thing that I use, um, it, that I do is my eyes and I typically do use the Urban Decay Naked Ultimate Basics palette and um, obviously most of the colours in here are like neutral colours and um, so they're perfect for like everyday kind of thing and the, the colours that I mostly use um, for like my everyday look are these top four in this corner and then maybe sometimes these two in the bottom <coughs> I'm just dying, don't mind me. So I'm going to use a flat brush first um, and I'm just going to pack nude all over the lid and that kind of helps set it all a little bit. And then next I'm going to be using a fluffy blending brush and I'm going to be going in with Faith, which is this bottom one here. And that's just going to go obviously in the crease and um, yeah, going out. So the next colour I will be using is a lockout. It's a little bit dark, darker than the one that we've just used and that will be literally going in the crease. Like not going through that or anything like that. So the next colour I will be using is Tempted, which is um, like the fourth on the wall. And I'm going to be using a um, flat brush again, um, and then just kind of packing that on in the corner of the eye and like coming in a little bit. We're in about half of it. And then with the same brush, I'm going to go in with a slightly lighter one, which is Commando. And that one's just going to sit in the inner corner, going back to the um, like line that we've just made with um, Tempted. And it might not look like much yet, but I'm going to come in with that fluffy blending brush and I'm just going to work it all together really. Like that, and then I'm going to come in with this really, really short and flat brush. And what I'm going to do with this bit, I'm going to go back in with Faith. And that's going to go along the bottom lash to about halfway from the outside corner of the eye. And I think that kind of like um, helps bring the look all together a little bit. And I'm just going to go in with Commando that we used in the inner corner. And it's kind of like meet up with um, her faith. Like this, and um, we're still not finished on the eyes yet, so don't get registered. Uh, we're going to go in with blue, which is the lightest shade, and it makes a really, really lovely colour for the inner corner of the eye, just to make the whole look pop. And yeah, that's what we're going to do with that one. And I pretty much use this um, colour for my inner corner, like on every single makeup look. So yeah, it's just really lovely. I love it so much. And I'm also going to be putting this along the brow burn as well. And then it kind of ties in all of the um, look that we've just done with our eyes. So there's the eyeshadow. Now for my like, everyday look, I don't really use um, liquid eyeliner much. Um, I just obviously do the eyeshadow and then put the mascara on because I do like to make it look um, a lot more like natural, like a no makeup kind of look um, on my eyes. So. I use the Better Than Sex Mascara from Too Faced and I absolutely love this, like so much. And I also put some uh, mascara and like the full side bottom lashes. So now that that's all the eye look complete, I'm going to go with my favourite part of my makeup which is highlight. And for most of my everyday looks when I'm just going like to like the town or anything like that, um, I use the Jeffree Star and the Money Anywhere collab in Eclipse and oh, I absolutely love this colour, it's so, so gorgeous and I think it goes really well with my skin colour, it just looks really natural and really cute. So 
So what I do is I get this little white um, highlighting brush right here and I just kind of really pack it on the brush and then just kind of make the way from my eyebrow coming down along the um, my uh, cheekbone. Yeah, it might not look like much at the moment, but then when you go out in the sun and the light here, it looks absolutely gorgeous. It looks stunning. Like, I don't have like professional lighting or anything in here that's going to make it pop or anything like that. So, yeah. But no, and I just do like this, and then I put a little bit on my nose. And going down my nose as well. And then I put some on my cupid's bow. And it just looks really natural. And really cute. And then I'm gonna go in with a fan brush and I'm literally gonna go back in with my cheeks because I love the highlight. Now I don't even usually like close my palette properly because it's so hard to open when you know I do try and open it. And I don't know if it's just my palette or if it's like everyone's highlighter that does this. But yeah, let me know in the comments below if yours does exactly the same. Like honestly, it's so difficult to open. So now that that's all of the makeup, there's just one last thing to do and that's a lipstick. Now most of the time when I am just doing my everyday look, I always use Celebrity Skin by Jeffree Star. It's so comfortable to wear, like you don't even know you've got it on. And um, you know, you can drink, you can eat and it doesn't come off and it's just absolutely brilliant for like everyday wear kind of thing. So yeah, let's um, put this baby on. I always put way too much lipstick on and then it doesn't actually like cover my like, lips, if that makes sense. It always goes like over my lips. So yeah. Um, and obviously the last but certainly not least step is my All Nighter Urban Decay Setting Spray. And obviously this is my like second favourite part and yeah. And there you have it, this is my everyday look. And um, this is, like I said, um, basically the look that I go to every single day if I'm not really sure on what to do. Um, you know, if it's just like a casual kind of day, um, yeah, then I will go through this and this is what I come out with all the time. If anyone who's like really into beauty like comes across this video they'll probably cringe at like every single bit because I probably don't do it right but this, this is just the way that works for me and this is just like you know the order and everything that I do it in so it kind of works for me. Everything that I have used I will put in the description down below you know along with all of my social media and that kind of thing and um, so yeah I hope you enjoyed the video I hope you like the look Tell me what your like, everyday lipstick is, everyday like palette is and all that kind of thing in the comments down below and I would love to read them all, maybe get some um, tips and that kind of thing. But yeah, if you like the video please give it a thumbs up and if you would like to see more of me then you know, subscribe, press that button down below and yeah, I hope to see you in my future videos. Thank you so much for watching, bye!